I, I'm going to ask you guys to go back to your car, and we're going to deal with them. Okay, there's no reason for you to be here. I understand that. I, under, I understand that, ma'am. I'm not going to ask you again. Okay, there's no. You're not going to listen. Listen to me. Okay. She's not a minor. She's an adult. Okay. And this is our scene. Okay. We have us over here. I don't need more people here than we already have. Ma'am, I'm gonna ask you one more time to go, then I will arrest you. I will I will arrest you, okay? You need to get off my scene. Thank you very much. You can stand on that side over there, but you're not gonna be over here. I'm not on your scene. Take it over past the railroad tracks. I do this is an officer safety issue. I do not need you over here. Do you understand me? Take it over there. Um, are you gonna end up arresting the daughter for unregistered motor vehicle? Well, Un uninsured, unregistered? Okay. Okay. That's a citation. It's not a, it's not a okay, so I, I guess that's that's grandma coming over here and she's wanting to that, stir up. That lady? The lady over there, yeah. She wants to come over and stir up stuff. So I asked her to leave. Okay. She wants to record and say that she can do whatever she wants. So I told her if she comes back she's gonna go to jail. So in a, in a firm with an investigation. Absolutely. Be over yep. I mean I'm taking care of business. I need mean, I well, I'm here. Do what you got to do. Do what you got to do. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Hey, I appreciate it, but we're, we're right now. Yep. Nope. Sir, I'm going to ask you to leave. I'm going to ask. Nope, sir. I'm going to ask you to leave right now. You're in the middle of our investigation. I'm going to ask you to leave. You're, 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 make, you're making this a lot harder than it has to be. You need to get off. Sir, right now, this is our investigation. You're, you're in our investigation. Have a nice day. You can stand over the sidewalk over there. Just make trying, some. He's make, the one that's trying to start the YouTube channel. That's fine. Make some action so we can get out of here. Say it's two thirty-four, man. All right. Do you have another signal or signal fifty-five for eight minutes? Favor, I, I, I know, I know you want to talk to him. I know him. Yeah. I know him. Yeah, he's, no, he's I know him. Yeah. yeah. I'm going to go ahead and put this guy in handcuffs if he's not going to get off our scene. Routine. All right, I'm going to get this guy off. Hey, sir, listen to me. I'm asking you to please get off our scene. Take your stuff. You can get off our scene or I'm going to put you in handcuffs and I'm going to take you to jail. All right? You need to go, okay? Thank you. Right now, we're not going to have this conversation. You want to talk to me after we're done with our investigation? You can. But don't interfere with what we're doing over here. Thank you. Do not interfere with what we're doing over here. Hey, that guy, 
he's trying. Is he leaving? No. If he if he interferes one more time, he's, he's going to go to jail. He, he's the boy, you know, familiar with that guy? I've, I've, I think I've heard it before, but he's, he tries to fit, walks up to cars and film shit and everything. This is a whole cluster fucking. It's longer than it needs. Sir, do not step back over here again. I'm telling you, if you come back in our vicinity, I will take you to jail. Step back. Step back. No, go ahead. No, no, go ahead. Put your phone down. I'll get it. 6234 man, show me white male obtain. 1040, you still need 655. Routine. 1040, I've asked you to stay off our scene. No, you're not staying off our scene. You're interacting, and I asked you to stay back. Do you have anything in your pocket you're not supposed to? Anything to poke me, stick me, harm me, hurt me? Have a seat. Have a seat. Have a seat. I'll speak to you in a minute. Have a seat. Almost done over here. Okay. Okay. I'll deal with him when you're done over here. Yeah. Actually, you good? You got an eye on everything? Yeah. All right. How do you How do you communicate? That's all you need? Okay. Here. I'll tell you what. Listen to what I'm telling you, okay? I've asked you not to interfere. Nope. I asked you not to interfere. You ended up communicating over here when I told you you couldn't. Then you continued to pass the line in the sand when I asked you not to. Okay? We're not going to play this game. I understand what you're trying to do, but right now we already have enough tension going on with what's going on over here. Do you understand that? Okay? So, so right now, you need to just respect what we're doing, okay? And we're going to go from there. All right? Stand up.
Just put your hand on top of your head as soon as I take the handcuff out, okay? Keep it, keep it on your head for me. Go ahead and have a seat back in the car. Have a seat back in the car. Okay, have a seat. Units, 10 4 for 6. 10 4. Hey, uh, yeah, you guys in the area or any of you in the area? Uh, there's a gentleman who was coming up on our scene while we're dealing with a traffic accident and he's trying to video and, and film us. Uh, I asked him to step back. He starts interacting with our uh, victim suspect or the vehicle accident. I asked him to not interact or interfere, step back past the line. He's still over here trying to film us. He's detained in the back seat of my car while we're conducting our, our business here on the traffic stop. Um, he's requesting a supervisor. Delta 9, or I'm sorry, Delta 14, yeah, yes sir. I didn't, I didn't, I asked him not to, to pass the line, he's coming over here, I, I tell him that we're not to interact over here, he's coming over, he's getting up to our cars, filming it, filming us while we're trying to do what we're doing, I asked him, please step back, I'll talk to him afterwards. And he's still trying to interact with us, so I detained him because it's getting a little ridiculous. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I, I, I just have him detained right now. I don't really care. I, I mean, I'll take him to jail, but right now I'm just trying to get done what we're doing because we've got uh, parents showing up. Uh, both subjects are arguing back and forth. and. Everybody, he was, nope, he was not. He just showed up to, to film us. He's got his little information. He wants to handle, hand us while we're on the scene. And he's a guy who, who has a, who can't talk. He has to use a machine to talk. So I don't know if you're familiar with him. All right. So it looks like we're about ready to be done here. And I'm good to set him free. But at the end of the day, I mean, that's just where, where we're at right now. You said?
Say it what? Flows. I, that's the trouble with trucks. It just flows. I got it pulls it out and into the back of it. There's a thing that was, because you can, all the information that you typed for the driver exchange, you can populate it to other forms. You just click on the person's name and it'll populate it all, but it's switching over. It just flows on it. Okay. The, I'm going to do, if she can, you know what, she can argue all she wants. Well, um. Well, insurance, what is it, 24, 20, what is it, 22nd? That's two days for insurance. She has no insurance, she bottom line. Insurance. What's up with this dude? What are you doing with him? I'm sorry? What are you doing with this dude? Well, Did you let him go? I, 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 it's up to him. I mean, I'll get him for obstruction, but right now I'm just, I'm just trying to make sure that we don't have all these people coming over to us. Hey, Rizachi. Yeah. Yeah. Hold on. I think it was trying to hook up my car. Um, yeah, so it was a signal for, I was at the gas station getting a drink, and there was a signal for involving, uh, looks like a great Chrysler. She cut around, uh, cut across three lanes of traffic, and in the path of oncoming traffic, he hit her. Um, she gets out, she immediately runs up and starts cussing and screaming and yelling at him, hitting on his door. Um, I didn't watch it happen. Somebody ran into the store and grabbed me, but I watched her go and engage him. And she said she had a, a signal 44 in the car. She was freaking out. I got everybody calmed down. I moved them over to uh, the Realty store right next to the uh, Liberty Tax. So we get them over here. Uh, Delta 14 comes over to do the uh, traffic crash. And, and, and uh, turns out the girl who caused the accident doesn't have insurance. She doesn't have uh, registration. Um, they're, they're acting foolish, she's arguing, then all of a sudden her grandmother shows up, her grandmother starts getting into it, wants to sit here and record us. I told her grandmother to step um, step back, stay off our scene, and she's like, oh, you know, all, all upset that we're telling her we don't want her over here. I explained to her, this is an officer safety, it's our investigation, we don't need you over here, let us do our job. Um, yeah, and then, and then um, shortly after that, some gentleman shows up, uh, He's got a speech issue. He can't talk. He has to talk by using a machine. So he comes over. He's literally right up to the door of my car, filming up in there. And he's just some Joe citizen. Has nothing to do with this situation or this accident. Um, I told him to step back, that he is impeding our investigation, and he will be placed in handcuffs. He needs to step back. And he's telling me, uh, he's, I can't say he's telling me, he is holding up a sign, and, and I kind of know what his deal is. But he's not rapid to move. So I escorted him to the sidewalk and I said, you can stay over here, you can film us as much as you want, but do not cross the line over here. We're doing an investigation. I do not need you interacting because then he goes and he's interacting with the, uh, the um, people in the accident. So he's over there interacting with them. So I told him, do not come back, do not interact, do not cross my line, uh, or I will put you in handcuffs. And so he does and I go ahead and put him in handcuffs and escort him to the car, but yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Well, I, right now I'm, I'm good with, as long as I can get him for obstruction, but right now I just wanted to make sure that everything is safe here. So he, Delta 14 can do his investigation. And as long as he's not, I mean, if, if you know, Yeah, he's detained right now. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. We'll do. Yes, absolutely. I agree. Thanks.
Do you want? Are you coming out here? Not, no need to, right? Perfect. Sounds good. Yes, sir. All right. So here's the deal. All right. You are going to be placed under arrest for obstruction. Okay. Yeah, Do you, what the nine. It, listen to me. All right. If you have a if you have a complaint or or if you want you can talk to him. Listen, listen to me. You're not gonna. Okay. Have a nice day. Six two thirty formation. We ten fifteen. White male. to stick around. I mean, it's the other party's not here. They left. Well, I'm talking about the. She seems like she's calmed down. She's not as scared. Okay. How much longer are you going to be? No, that's fine. Nope. You good? Take your time. She was cutting across the parking lot. Alright, sir, listen, listen to what I'm going to tell you, okay? You're already hard enough to understand. I'm not going to sit here and have a conversation with you when every time I do, you talk over me. We're not going to do it, okay? So when we get to the jail, we can establish everything that you need. You need... Your, your stuff is in the car and you'll have it when we get to the jail. Do you need medics? Do you need medics? When when you get to the jail, you can ask the the nurse. I. They will have yes, they will. They'll have what you need. Okay. So I asked you to step off the scene and to stop interacting. Okay. I'm sorry? I said this internet thing is so it's got to switch to edit mode and it, it takes a minute. You know the connection. Right. Dude, I'm giving her uh, 
registered motor vehicle, six months or less, is which it is. Yep. Have you ever used drugs? This, no. Victor 59 on a white mini Cooper. All the info is citations and stuff. So. Um, and then, uh, expired tag, six months or less, no proof of insurance on crash, and then careless driving. Because you put over three lanes. Yep. Tell you so. All right. So this vehicle cut across while I was getting a drink okay. at the gas station. Cuts across into the lane of traffic and gets hit. Okay. They immediately get out, engage the driver, start hitting on the door. So it turns into a 22 verbal right in the middle of the, the road. So I got everybody separated, got them to come over here. While we're over here and he's doing what he's got to, then then Grandma shows up who's over there, and I asked her to step off the scene and go back there. She's back there, she's not bothered, but she was all up in here video, and so I asked her to step back. She she did. Then all of a sudden, the guy who doesn't talk, you know what I'm talking about, you do, who uses the machine to talk into, yeah. comes over, he literally, right up at my window, he's sitting there recording in my car and all over, and I said, sir, we don't need this right now, we're in the middle of an investigation, I need you to take your take it over there, and then he comes over and he starts talking to them, getting in the middle of the investigation. I told him if he's if he crossed the line again, I'm going to go ahead and put him in cuffs. So he's unrelated to this whole incident? Totally unrelated. Okay. Oh, so 100%. Then I went ahead okay. and uh, placed him under, yeah. So he's he's under arrest. He's knocking on your window? Was, everything was on, right? This was on the whole time? Yeah. Perfect. Yeah. 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 So, um. But, did he impede his investigation at all? Yeah, so he was in the, so we're sitting here trying to let him do what he's got to do as far as this. And so, yes, it's his investigation, but ultimately, you I'm... You're holding the perimeter as well. Right. Solid. Yeah. Right. 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 I love it. And that's the guy that always... That's the guy who came up to me and you at the gas station. Yeah. He's, he's, what he's trying to do is he's trying to, to, trying to get arrested so that he can somehow accuse us of violating his rights. So, that's what he's doing. And he gave him Mm -hmm. okay. uh, do we have the second car? The second car already left, so. Yeah, she has unregistered motor vehicle, no insurance. Uh, so, he's just dealing with that, obviously. She cut across the lanes of traffic. Oh, okay. It looks pretty good damage, too. Well, it's, it's nice not to get lunch again. He's 100% working the crash. Yeah. He's <laughs> in the shade. It's hot. I'm not gonna lie to you. We were coming out here saying, what nonsense. It's Dinellan, man. I'm telling you. Right, I, I get it. This, uh, I've dealt, I've dealt with this guy a few times, and this has been. A well, it was one thing when it's just when it's them, and we're going to try and handle it. But then he comes over and starts to interject and add in. Is he the only one that's out? Yeah, yeah, because they got Delta Nine on the KP hole. Sorry. They still got a couple more. Not when they got the KP hole to cover. Well, now that you're here, I'm going to go ahead and take my guy. Just make sure that he's good. Well, is he going to 15? No, but he's got a few citations. He expects that they're going to be yeah, upset. So that's why he asked me to stay. So.
All right, I'm going to go ahead and get out of here. Uh, you got two deputies over here, okay? Yeah. You need anything else from me? No, I'm, I'm trying to finish this up. I was just getting ready to type in the amount. She put me on that Delta 15 call. And I, might ask you to do a, I might ask you to do an AOA report on this. All right, but I'll call you later. Yeah. Talk to him at the jail. to the jail. I cannot understand what you're saying. You want me to turn the AC down? I don't have anything up here, but I can't. I cannot stop. I'm sorry. Uh, well, I'm 10, 15 right now, heading to CJ. Um, and I'm 10, 12. But uh, it was a traffic accident that female cut across uh, several lanes of 
traffic leaving the Circle K and to the traffic of on or into the lane of oncoming traffic. She got hit. As soon as she got hit, she gets out of her vehicle and starts like 22 verbal in the middle of the road. Uh, I go over, break it up, get them to head over to the parking lot um, until Delta 14 could get there. And then while he was doing his traffic uh, investigation, they, uh, the, 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 I guess the grandparents of the driver at fault comes over and starts videotaping and just being in the middle of the scene. So I asked them to leave the scene and that, and not to interfere any further. They did. And then shortly after that, this gentleman who, I'm sure you're familiar with him, he, he doesn't he doesn't talk, he uses a machine to talk. Yeah, he came and started interfering in the investigation, got up in the, uh, the uh, my car with his cameras videotaping it. I asked him to uh, step back. He's, he's going to talk over. He's going to talk over me now. But ultimately, he interacts with the the people after I asked him to not interfere. So he goes over and he starts interacting with them. I asked him to step back. He does, and then I told him not to cross the line. And I turn around, and there he is, inching his way back towards us. So I went ahead and placed him under arrest for interference. Yeah, yeah, he's trying to get done. There's just too much going on. Everybody's getting in the middle of it. So. Well, I've got two deputies down there with I got two deputies down there with him now, so he should he should be finishing up soon. But yeah. No, no. Yeah, there's just too many distractions, too much going on. So So, yeah, yeah, otherwise it, yeah, otherwise, I mean, she didn't have a, uh, uh, insurance and she didn't have a, uh, registration. So. Yeah, yeah, and of course she says that she did renew it and it just hasn't renewed yet. Well, of course, that's what she says and it's. It's expired, and then her insurance was expired. So while we were on scene, she went ahead and renewed her insurance, which I explained to her she can't do that after an accident. But so, but whatever. Yeah, yeah, it's your, it is your fault for sure. I told you you'll have a supervisor when you get to the jail you can talk to one uh, it doesn't work like that no sir it doesn't work like that okay. okay you'll have an opportunity to speak to a supervisor when you get to the jail He's talking about the storm back there. Oh, yeah. Oh, of course. All right, later. Tip, sir.
Voice command. Exit. Stop route. see him on a bicycle, I saw him walk up. I'm sorry. Well, why don't you do me a favor? Since you're since you're there, can you go ahead and collect it? Go ahead and put it at your office, do an AOA report. Um, then you can do a follow-up, like, you can just put, put, put what you saw here, and then that way you can just hold it, because I didn't know he had a bike over there. Is it, do you have a bike? Sir, do you have a bike? No. He said, he said he doesn't have a bike. So. Okay. I, I don't know. He says he doesn't answer questions, so I'm I'm not going to sit here and, and uh, make assumptions on whether... I didn't see him come up on a bike. He says he doesn't... No, I just... Uh, he doesn't answer questions. He's going to leave it there. Yeah. Yeah, I appreciate it. Thanks. Sir, there's no reason for you to be trying to talk because every time I try and ask you a question, you're not talking to me, so all you're doing is just... Okay. If you don't mind putting his uh, 1043 in the call, that way I can... Okay. Well, if...
If you can find it, great. If not, I'll figure it out when I get to the jail. I'm just trying to get a jump on it. Uh, it's fine. I'm I'm not gonna have more conversations with them back here. So. Yeah. Yeah. TFO. All right, man. It sounds like it's in mode. Yeah. All right. Well, fair enough. We'll get it figured out when we get to the jail. No, not really. That's what he's trying to. He's what he's trying to be. Yeah. All right. Well, let me let you go. All right.
Let me, let me tell you, because I can hear a little bit of what you're saying, okay? Uh, I couldn't, I can hardly understand you and you talk over me. So I'm not going to play back and forth, okay? I'll listen to you when it's your turn to talk, but at the end of the day, if you continue to do this, you have to follow what the, what the deputy or the officer tells you. You can't... Until I get out of the car, because I really don't understand you. Let me um, let me go book him in, and then I'll go dock it into evidence. Oh, I can watch it right now. Yeah, I can watch it on my phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Ten four, ten four. What? All right. Yep. Ten four.
problem but Nope, come on, I don't need to put you in handcuffs. You didn't leave anything in the car, did you? You don't have anything on you that you're... What is it? No, you're, you're fine. Listen to me. Listen to me. All right. You don't have anything on you you're not supposed to. Okay. I right, just want to make sure that you know if anything goes into jail. All right. Just want to make sure you knew that. All right, go ahead and stand up on the wall for me. Yep. Have you ever been in here before? You're going to wait till you get booked. Once you get booked in, they'll let you make phone call. Sir, stand up against the wall. Okay, just, just stand there, you're fine. 6234 LGR. 
description of obstruction. George. Uh, yeah, I'm in booking right now. As soon as I get him through booking, I'll I'll come back out there. All right. Yep. What's your phone number? Okay. Okay. Get, grab a nurse really quick just so that we're 10 4 with it. Have you had close contact with laboratory confirmed case of COVID? Yeah. Yes or no? Yeah. Have you had close contact? Yeah. Have you traveled outside the country in the last 14 days? This is why you get charged with obstruction because we're, we're here trying to do, listen to what I'm telling you, okay? All right, these are COVID questions, okay? And we're trying to make sure that everybody here is safe, okay? Bob. 
He won't answer the COVID questions either. Yeah. He's uh, not answering the COVID questions. So then, yeah. to dump everything into that box, but I...
Got this. Complete.